my essay was about um, genome-wide chromatin loops and how they can function in transcription. Um, so during my PhD, we developed a new method for understanding chromatin interactions through uh, combining the existing uh, chromosome confirmation capture methodologies uh, with paired end uh, sequencing, which is very high throughput. So using this new at a high throughput unbiased uh, method, we were able to identify uh, chromatin interactions that were bound to estrogen receptor alpha, which is a very important uh, transcription factor in human breast cancer. And it's important, an important drug target for treatment. So what we did was that we found uh, that these chromatin interactions are associated with uh, transcription regulation, thus suggesting that it's an important mechanism in gene control. Uh, well, I was always interested in science ever since I was young, so it seemed quite natural for me to choose science as a career, and at the age of 18, uh, I decided uh, to take up the Agency for Science, Technology and Research uh, scholarship from the Singapore government. So after that, um, I became a scientist. Well, um, the prize gives me a lot of uh, confidence. I mean, it's a great honour. It's a, it's a wonderful award. And um, coming to Sweden, I've gotten to know so many wonderful people. I've gotten to know the GE healthcare people, um, the science people. Um, it's all been a wonderful experience. And um, in the future, I, I hope to uh, to build on these uh, professional networks. I'd always seen um, the GE Science Prize logo on the science website when I was reading articles, you know, on the Science Careers website as well, on the table of contents that I would get in my email. So um, I, I, I looked at the prize, I knew about it, and um, I always thought that at the end of my PhD, I, I would try to apply for this award. <laughs>